Hey, Anki Shadows here, and today I'm going to do an off-schedule Pokemon Showdown thing because I want to show you the awesome thing they did for April Fool's Day, which is today. And what they've done is they've changed it to Digimon Showdown. And as you can see, they got a nice Digimon picture here. I'm not sure whether you can change the background. Yeah, there you go. It says experiencing technical difficulties. So yeah, you can't change the background. It's just permanently the Digimon one. And if we get into a random battle, you'll see the wonders they have done with these sprites. So, yeah, there you go. So this is Lugia here, looking completely unlike it usually does. And then Unpheasant on the other side. So basically what they've done is they've drawn them like a two-year-old would. And it's quite brilliant. <laughs> and okay, that was a not not expected. I just saw another couple Pokemon, but the substitute is now a pay no attention to what's behind the sign sign, which I guess is to distract the. Yeah. Uh, whoever made this, props to them for this absolutely brilliant update. I think this is. I hope they just stay like this forever. Well, there's no need to change that around or anything. And Whimsicott looks like. I don't even know. It's so badly drawn. I like this one as like a little fab thing. I'm gonna try and get make sure I show all the Pokemon, but So the the moves said the same. Basically they've just changed the sprites for literally everything. Which is kinda of funny. <laughs> oh god, Morwal just looks so awful. What like what even is that? Um, yeah, it looks like a two-year-old's drawn them, but it's just kind of... Hey! A crafty little, um, Mario reference there. You got, uh, what, what are they called? I forget what they're called. Chain Chomps, that's it. And Reniculus has become a triangle. I presume that looks funnier from the front, but I can't really tell what that is. And for some oh, it's in a slice of actual jelly. Like that's a picture of a slice of jelly. And I'm gonna go with Shadow. Ball. Pay no attention to what's behind the sign again. Really, I I really like some of these. Like uh, the other game I was playing, they had what's his name? Ah, oh, I forgot the name of it. Um, it'll come to me in a sec. Golurk, that's it. Yeah, Golurk, which is, for some reason, has the ability to fly in the anime using jets. So they have, like, a picture of it flying, and it's just a fuck logic on it. Alright, so, okay, that Pangoro that looks completely retarded. Uh, <laughs> that's gonna take me out, and I'm gonna switch into Lugia. I assume Lugia looks like, like, uh, Tweety Bird, is that what they call it? I don't know. And that's Pangora down, so I'm not doing too well in this battle. Like, at all. It's really distracting, just the weirdness of the characters. But no, I think that's the point. Oh god, Stantler, what did they do to you? And Venusaur, even worse! That is just painful. What did they do to you, Venusaur? Uh, Stantler has Intimidate, so I don't need to worry about the... I think I can get Sap Sipper. I'm not sure. Oh. I don't know. It doesn't say, so... And Unpheasant again. Uh, what items does this have? Oh, this is Mega. I totally forgot I was using Mega. Um... Sidder Widow looking like a piece of shit with corn in it. It's pretty accurate to the original, actually. Come on, switch into a new Pokemon. I, I want to see a good selection of these. And he's got that Intimidate up again, which is kind of annoying. 
I'll put Stealth Rock in if it stays one more turn. Okay, he got taken out one turn. So I'll put Stealth Rock in, unless they switch into... They're probably going to switch into... Ooh, Dialga. But it looks really weird because of the background, but there's a grey bit there. Some sort of grey bit. Anyway. That should look better, but it's just because of the background. But it still looks... You can you can imagine, like, round here. And the little spikes coming off that it usually has. And the roller camp actually doesn't look too bad. It does look like they used, like, um... What? Oh, that is cool. That is actually incredibly cool. Uh, hold on. I need to, um... I need to show you that, because that's really cool, but... I'll just forfeit it. And team builder. I, I don't know, I'll just make this sign. I'll just add... Give them some random moves. Uh, this was a choice band. I already had this one set up, so I might as well just give it what it's supposed to have. Alright, and then I'll add one with Earthquake. Actually, this can have Earthquake. And I'll give it some random ones, I don't know. Just fill up the set. Okay, and now we're gonna go to... Wait, what's the lowest this can be registered? Because I really want to at least get one hit off of this. Nudo King, King is Yu Yu. Alright. So we'll go on Yu Yu. I just want to show you what happened when Earthquake was used. Which was actually really cool. I don't know if this could actually just be an update. I'm not entirely sure. But. Let's switch to this scene. Alright. Oh god, look at that team. Um, half of them are like, sort of nice, just in a kind of cutesy look. And some of them are just spazzed out, like... What is that? Oh, that's part of Heracross, that's his arm. And that Nido King just looks absolutely awful. Alright, and now we're gonna see what Earthquake does when you're running. Moves the screen. It's brilliant. Oh, that's salt this actually helped. Um... I'm just going to do Earthquake again, make sure you saw that. So that goes on and off screen. And then this one's going to kind of get screwed up. It looks like um, Bambi. But it's really small now. Yeah, I imagine they'd switch that, but I, I don't I didn't really want to win that. I just want to show you. Anyway, so that was the... I hope April Fool's Day. I hope it doesn't stay like that forever. Ooh, look, <laughs> um, Goffy XL looks brilliant. That one actually looks like a viable Pokemon. But perhaps not a Mega. Um, anyway, this was the update for April Fool's Day. I hope you enjoyed this. I know it was just kind of an off the cusp video. I didn't have anything particularly in plan. I just wanted to show you the really funny things that some company has been doing for April Fool's Day. I hope you enjoyed this video. Check out some of my other stuff. Like and subscribe and all that. And I will see you next time.